and she's a little helicopter. He is brave, a little hero. Budgie and friends are always working hard together. Pip and Chuck and Lionel in a new adventure. Budgie! Rocketing rotors. Oh. Budgie's a little helicopter. He is nippy, look at him go with Budgie. Budgie, Pippa and Chuck had been to an air show in France. Now they were getting ready to go back home to Harefield Airfield. I'm going to get loaded up, Pippa. All right, Budgie. I'm just waiting for Mr. Harrison. Say, Budgie, don't forget to fuel up this time. <laughs> Budgie, Pippa, Chuck. Lionel? Where are you all off to, eh? We're going back to Harefield. No, you're not. Change of plan. What are you doing here, Lionel? Keeping an eye on you. Oh? To stop you getting into any more mischief. Uh... And anyway, we're not going home. We're going to Holland. Holland? Pippa will be flying Mr. Harrison there, and I shall be carrying the members of a small brass band. Gosh! Chuck. Yes, Captain? Uh, Lionel? You'll take their instruments. Hey, 76 trombones, huh? <laughs> what? Uh, okay, Lionel. Hmm. And you, Budgie, will be carrying that. Gosh. Is that supposed to be the Eiffel Tower? What's it for? It's pretty weedy. We've seen the real thing, and... Yes, thank you, Budgie. You just have to carry it, all right? Yes, Lionel. Well, let's get moving. Scramble, scramble. All right? Yes, yes Lionel. Lionel. Snowy, I've never seen anywhere so flat. There aren't any rocketing rotors. That's the biggest helicopter I've ever seen. And it looks as if it's crashed near the river. Hang on, Snowy, I'm going down. Hello? Are you all right? speaks Dutch. Hello? Can I help you? It must have got stuck in the ground, Snowy. Could you fly yourself out? Can you get your engine going? Why not try... Whoops! Oh! Now I'm stuck too. And I can't see a thing. Oh, gosh. Maybe if I get my tail rotor going. Like you were the windmill's kid brother? A giant helicopter. <laughs> Windmill? Oh, so that's what they look like. <laughs> oh, lovely. Hello. What are they doing? Oh, 
Pudgy, Pippa to Chuck. Can anyone hear me? I'm here, Pippa. Chuck's gone ahead with the instruments. I've dropped Mr. Harrison off at the airport, and I'm taking a look round. I've just spotted some men stealing flowers and loading them into a truck. Crumbs! Where are you? About 12 miles southwest of Amsterdam. Keep circling, and I'll be with you as quick as I can. Over and out. Oh, gosh. I do hope he's quick. Oh, no! They're moving! Pippa to Budgie! They're driving off! Hurry! Stay with them, Pippa. I'm on my way. Oh, I wish I could stop them. Hey! Crazy plane! I can see you, Pippa. And the truck. Let's get after it. And he thought it was what? He thought the windmill was a giant helicopter. Juddering joysticks. And fell on his nose trying to talk to it. <laughs> Budgie, whatever next? That's where Mr. Harrison's gone. He's watching some sort of parade. I've got to pick him up when it's over. Well, now I've got rid of that silly Eiffel Tower thing, we might as well watch it too. Looks like it is the truck. Come on. That's the truck, Pippa. And those are the two men unloading the flowers. But I don't think they were stolen at all. What? I think they picked them for the floats. Those sort of decorated trucks. They must be what Mr. Harrison's come to see. After all that. Oh well. Let's take a look. <laughs> Hey, what goes on there? They're cheeses. They're carrying them off to be weighed. That's cheese? Wow, crazy! Hey, look! Up there! It's Pudgy and Pippa!
We are proud of you, Budgie. We sure are, kiddo. Hey, look at that! The Eiffel Tower! A flower power Eiffel Tower! <laughs> so that's what it was for. And there's something else. 